One of the new features in Excel 2013 is that you can create a pivot chart directly from your data without creating a pivot table first. So here I have a list of sales and I'm going to select a cell in this table, go to the insert tab, and here I see recommended charts. I'll click on that. Here's a list of the recommended charts and at the top right of some of them you'll see the pivot table symbol. So I'll scroll down and further down the list you can see some regular charts and you can see how messy they are. They're just pulling all the data from this giant table. But if I look up at the ones that have this pivot table symbol, they're summarized. So this one is the price by city. This one is the total sales by customer and this one is total price by category. So this one looks like a good choice. The total sales by customer. I'll click OK. It creates a new sheet in the workbook. It builds the pivot table for me. And there's the pivot chart that I wanted. So it saves you time because you don't have to build the pivot table first and figure out how to arrange the fields so that they're going to look the way you want them in the pivot chart. For more Excel tips and tutorials, please visit my Contextures website at www.contextures.com.